DGATE is a decentralized exchange or DEX protocol built on zero knowledge or ZK technology that aims to provide a user experience similar to centralized exchanges without the inherent security risks of such exchanges. DGATE is a grand and challenging project that is working towards a fully decentralized limit order trading protocol built on a DAO-centric model. All liquidity comes from the community and all income belongs to the DAO. The protocol enables several functions, including spot trading and grid trading, with more features to be added to enable a coherent trading experience. Here are five reasons why traders should consider switching to DGATE. Reason number one, zero knowledge or ZK technology. ZK Rollup technology is one of the most promising solutions being developed to scale the Ethereum blockchain. Crucially, it increases scalability by processing a large number of transactions and rolling them into a transaction on a base layer, greatly reducing cost. As a ZK Rollup, DGATE fills a key gap in the market, where high gas fees have been a problem for quite a long time by providing spot order book trading and grid trading within the Ethereum ecosystem offering an experience similar to centralized exchanges. Based on ZK Snarks technology, DGATE processes the off-chain transactions, generates the zero-knowledge proofs, submits data to the blockchain, and verifies and ensures the reliability of the submitted on-chain data. To sum it all up, the use of ZK allows for achieving high throughput and low gas cost protocol. Reason number two, strong principles. The design of DGATE protocol is based on three core principles. Fully decentralized, DGATE aims to be an open network composed of thousands of nodes, where anyone can use the protocol by downloading a standalone open source client. Trustless, DGATE was designed such that the user always has the highest authority, and no malicious or centralized authority has access to the user's assets. In this sense, malicious actors can't do evil, through DGATE's non-custodial storing of assets, the whole system has no backdoor and admin key. Permissionless The whole system is an open protocol. Any token can be listed on DGATE by anyone, and anyone who has a blockchain wallet can directly use DGATE. Reason number three, security and trustlessness. To ensure that DGATE is a completely trustless, decentralized and permissionless limit order exchange, the trust mechanism of the entire DGATE protocol is guaranteed by three factors. Previously discussed, ZK Rollup data availability, the fact that there's no admin key requirement, and Exodus mode. An admin key allows the developers to arbitrarily change the rules of their smart contracts. The admin key is susceptible to attack for decentralized finance projects because it can enable a unilateral change of very crucial parameters, even including user balances. DGATE does not have an admin key. Once the protocol is deployed, its code execution logic is immutable. No one can change or upgrade it. Exodus mode on DGATE allows users to retrieve assets in their DGATE account without the involvement of any third party in case of emergency by directly providing data proof as a parameter to the smart contract. Users can restore their data from historical call data stored on Ethereum. Reason number four, DG token. DG is DGATE's native governance token with a total supply of 1 billion, 100% owned by Home DAO initially. The token was distributed to the community via a fair launch process. The token is used in Home DAO governance, initiated and approved resolutions with DG. Reason number five, DAO and community. DGATE is a DAO-centric protocol with a DAO fully controlling its treasury. The members of the DAO are DG token holders who participate in the governance process and delegate decision-making. DGATE is a protocol of the community, by the community, and for the community. DGATE Home DAO operates and controls DGATE protocol and is thereby entitled to the revenue generated. Amongst other key decisions, Home DAO can decide through the governance process what to do with the revenue generated. DG token holders can initiate governance protocols. Major matters will be decided by Home DAO. DGATE DAO maintains integrity through transparency, as all major financial updates will be made public in the following Google Sheets. The DGATE public testnet is now live. Since DGATE testnet runs on the Ethereum Gawley test network, you can get free testnet tokens to experience DGATE before the main launch, which is expected to happen in the second quarter of 2023.
Please note that testnet tokens are meant to only work in a testing environment, therefore will have no value in the main net. To start, go to the testnet website and connect your wallet. All it takes is a blockchain wallet to interact and use dgate. No user identity verification is required. Anyone can list and trade ERC20 tokens on dgate as long as a token fulfills the conditions set by the protocol. Maintaining the openness of token listing is important to dgate. Before a user can start trading, assets will first need to be deposited into their dgate account. So claim some testnet Ethereum and deposit any amount to the exchange. Upon doing so, dgate will airdrop you 200 testnet USDC and USDT. Let's now create a limit order. To do so, go to the testnet page and choose the pair you would like to trade on the top left. On the right, you can see the order book and buy and sell section. To buy some testnet DG tokens, we need to specify the price, amount and press buy DG, then place order and it's done. Grid strategy changing is a trading method that allows users to specify a price range in which the algorithm will automatically place orders to buy low and sell high to reap profits from price fluctuations. To create a grid strategy, go to the grid strategy page on the top left. Dgate website offers two grid strategy creation models, auto and manual. For the auto mode, the grid strategy parameters will be automatically filled according to recent trades, the user's account available balance, the minimum order size, and other data. The user can also adjust the values of the initial allocation parameter. For the manual mode, users are free to adjust any parameter. There will not be any difference in the created grid strategy between the auto and manual mode if the grid strategy parameters are the same. Price range comprises the lowest and highest grid price which the grid strategy will be operating within. Grid orders of this grid strategy will not exceed this price range. Initial allocation is the initial amount of funds that are locked to run the grid strategy. The quote token is needed for the buy grid order. The base token is needed for the sell grid order. The number of grids is the number of grid orders that will be running concurrently. This does not distinguish if the grid order is a buy or sell. There is a minimum of two grids and a maximum of 255 grids for a grid strategy. Quantity per grid, the buy and sell amounts are the same for each grid order. Grid width is an important factor affecting the profitability of the grid strategy. Expiring, the grid strategy will expire once the expiration duration is due. After you've chosen all of the parameters, press Create Grid Strategy and it's done. Additionally, as we can see here, if the token amount in your grid strategy exceeds a certain threshold, you're able to get mining rewards for providing liquidity to the order book. Dgate built a fast, safe and reliable trading exchange for DeFi users to trade effortlessly. Visit dgate.com and start today.